guys welcome and good morning so um something that i did while you were out is oh apparently throw my journal and the rest of the coffee dyed paper in the trash because this thing is too big <laughs> uh so if you watched my last video then you know that i made it oopsie and made this really really big but in order to save on some time of just gluing and whatnot, um, I'm actually, I didn't realize I had a tiny piece of this left. So anyway, um, I went ahead and covered the back of this paper. So there. So it saves a little bit of time on, you know, just watching me glue stuff down. And it's just coffee dyed paper kind of spread all over the place. Um, oh, I missed a spot right there. All right, so let's grab something that is coffee dyed ish esque. Uh, oh, look, that works. Boop. Right in the middle okay i was trying to grab like a scrap of something that i wouldn't have to tear apart a whole sheet because i do use my coffee dyed papers in the journals um i actually print on them a lot of times i will use the digitals of you know whatever kit it is that i'm using at the time i don't even know where i got that i just pulled it out of one of the folders so let's start working on this side. Oh yeah, I said I was going to zoom you guys out. I forgot. So let's zoom you guys out. That's the wrong direction. That's worse. All right. So you're going to see like all of the stuff over here that you normally don't see, but I think you might be able to see this a little bit better. Hopefully. Um, so let's go over here, grab our stickers from the kit. There's one of the flowers that we used. Um, and now we're just going to kind of put these all over the place. Um, we're going to start with areas that aren't covered at all. Uh, we don't need this right now because these are all on sticker paper. And we're gonna scooch. I just don't have the space. Oy. Like I said, this was not a very well thought out idea. All right. Uh, we'll grab one of these. Oh, that was a lot easier than I thought it would be. We'll come down here. There's a blank spot right there. And we'll cover that up. Okay. And there's a blank spot here, 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 and over here a lot. So we'll grab this one. And I do have my knife in my hand just in case I need it. It is covered just in case I have anyone worried I might stab myself. It is covered and it looks like I might actually need it. No, come open. Oh, there we go. Okay, can you see what I'm doing? Okay, good. And right now we're just covering holes. And this is all from uh, the digital kits from uh, Tsunami Rose. Let's see, we can probably put this one right there. I think that'll work. And I just, I printed these on uh, sticker paper and cut them out the other day. And now I'm fighting with them. All right, it's no longer covered. Y'all can 
Y'all can yell at me now. I'm not going to keep it covered, recovered, covered, recovered. I'm not doing that. All right. Um, what was that? Well, I know what it was, but that was my Etsy shop again. Don't mind that. I have to. I have my phone on me all the time because um, it's my my step tracker because I don't have a step tracker. Um, I just, I have this watch here, so this is just a regular old watch. Well, kind of, it's actually not. It doesn't have a battery or numbers for that matter, but it's a, it's a citizen. Um, what are those things called? Eco drive. Now my phone's going off. What is going on? Oh my gosh. Someone is having a heyday with my Etsy shop right now. Thank you for that, whoever you are. I doubt very seriously you're watching this right now, but thank you anyway. All right, um, this one, we're still covering holes right now. So we can, actually this one kind of matches this one. So if we put it right here, I think it would go well. And it'll cover up that giant empty space. Oh, goodness me. All right. So anyway, how are you guys doing? What's up? What's new? What's happening? What are you guys working on? What do you wish you were working on? Oh, that one's nice. And put that one right there. Alright. And then there's a hole right here and right up here. That's a pretty big hole. Um, so we'll see what we can do with that. All right. There we go. There's that one. And then this little guy here still, and then these guys up here. All right, so this one can cover that area. Um, this one can cover that, and then we'll left with that little bit and that little bit. Or do it like this, this, that actually covers almost all of it. Let's, I don't really want to put them all on top of each other like that. The whole point is to spread them out a little bit. So I'm going to grab paper here and we'll cover that like that and then this one perfect there we go all right so that is what we will do with that one so I do need you after all glue Oh, also, if you missed my last video, um, I did ask you guys if you prefer the longer videos versus the shorter videos, because I know I've had a lot of feedback, but I'm not sure, um, like, how many of 
the how much of the feedback is from people that watch every single day and comment every single day so i'm really looking for um the guys like you guys that show up every day like i really want to cater to you guys if that makes sense because i don't want to you know cater to someone who's not you know not here when there's other people that are asking for the opposite and they are here every day does that make sense all right so we have this little bit right here but i think that is easy enough to cover actually let's do it this way here yeah and poke that off all right i think that's what we're gonna do and this is just the uh, the coffee dyed that I printed on the sticker paper before I printed Tsunami Rose. So I printed a coffee dyed um, design, if you will. And then I printed Daisy's digitals on top of that. All right. Try and pull some of this glue off my hands with this, you know, paper because I'm throwing it away anyway. All right, so tilt tap y'all. All right, and this is what we have thus far. Okay, so we've got a lot of the Daisy stickers on this side, so I want to put some over here, and we have three left. So let's put this one right. Um, actually, let's put it right there. I like that idea. Where are you, sticky thing? Or pokey thing, more or less. Anyway, I hope that doesn't offend anybody, and I mean, I'm sorry if it does. That's not my intention, so just know that. Um, I'm just, I'm trying to uh, cater to the people that, you know, they're here every day, they show up every day, they comment every day, they watch every day, you know. You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. I really do. Still no idea how I'm going to cut this thing. No idea. Wow, I did that backwards. I, um, <laughs> I don't know if you guys caught it, but I took the sticker off and threw the sticker and kept the backing in my hand. If that made sense. All right, so we have a little bit right here, too, and we're going to cover that up. It's upside down writing. Um, let's see, let's put you, um, I don't know where I want to put you. Maybe right there. I might need more, um, more of these guys actually. All right. Um. Come here. There we go. Good job. Good job. Okay. So we're actually covering covering up a lot of this writing area, but that's okay because the back is completely blank and we can use that. All right. So the tsunami rose stickers are done. And a lot of this kit is very flower oriented. So, which is probably why I keep calling that a flower. Oh, and this is the cover that we finished, um, and I added the strings just in case you missed it in yesterday's video. Now I'm going to grab my flowers here and see what we have, because I have a lot that are um, kind of pale and pinky colored. I'm just going to take the whole thing out because I'm sure that's annoying. All right. There's white, pink, pink, peach colored, 
Uh, oh, I like those. Some more white. Roses. That's pretty. I like that one better than those, I think. Oh, that one definitely. Um, that one, that's pretty. These are tulips, right? Someone who knows flowers better than me, let me know. Some greenery might be cool. I don't think that one's gonna go. <laughs> uh, not in this book. That's cute. That's somewhere. These are all very dark roses. All right, so let's see what we have with this real quick and I think I might want to add a couple more of these white ones not that one now I'm looking at them backwards alright let's do those not the yellow ones either okay okay and then these are the um, the rice paper stickers. Uh, I do have these in my shop, by the way. They're under oh, that's what I was looking for. They're under stickers and embellishments. I'm pretty sure. All right. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw them on the floor. Oi, come here. I'm going to pepper them throughout here before I cut. Because again, it's the just put it down method. Don't think about it. I still feel like I need something right here, but it'll, it'll get, it'll get done. We'll work on it. This one is a book with a flower on top. Let's see, what is our time at? 17 minutes. See, aren't you glad I did the back on my by myself? Oh my gosh. All right. Otherwise, we'd be doing a third video just for these collage pieces. Oh. I'm probably going to cut this off camera only because I have no idea how I'm going to do it yet. No idea. Let's do this one. It's kind of just sitting there. Um, I might have to measure it down to 12 inches and cut it with my because I have a I have a metal yardstick and I might have to just use that and I have uh, I have cutting boards that are very lightweight so they're easily movable like I can move them around and such let's put you where do we want to put you? Let's put you over here. So I'm thinking that that's what I'm going to do, but I'm going to have to do it in my kitchen because there's a lot more room in my kitchen than there is on my desk. And I don't think I'm going to have the space on my desk to do that. Ooh, I like that. 
All right, so let's move down some. Oh, come here. Come out, you. Right, move down some. Look at this side a little bit. And uh, by the way, these flowers are pulled from uh, three different kits. So in my personal inventory, I have them all together. In the shop, they are separated. Like um, each different pack is going to have different flowers. Hmm. Oh, come on. You can do it. I know you can. No, that's the back end. Okay. Yeah. Ah, ha, ha. I win, Sticker. I win. <laughs> okay, let's put you right there. Uh, you know what? We're actually putting a lot of these vertical. Let's put them all over the place. Um, let's do this one not vertical. Come on. Wow, this one was really stuck to the acetate. Um, We'll put you right there. Oh, you can't see that. Put it all the way down at the bottom. You put it sideways. Okay. Ooh, I'm supposed to put something right there. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna put a crab ticket thingy. What else has a little bit of silver? Oh, did we already cover it? I think we already covered it. Because that's all I see. Yeah, we must have covered it. I think I've been through these. Ah. Oh. Give me one that matches what I'm doing. Oh, that's cool. That's got a tree. What in the world is that? I have no idea what that is. It doesn't sound, I don't think you guys heard it. You might have, but um, it was a siren, but it didn't sound like of any of the first responders that I'm used to hearing, like police, ambulance, fire. I'm not sure what it sounded like. All right, here we go. That hole is covered. Okay. My needs more flowers. That's it. Okay. Okay. Let's put you there. Yeah. Hi, Dina. Dina, come to say hi. You this way. Okay. And in, 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 in. I like these red and pink ones. I think we'll put them up there.
you right there. And then I feel like we need something right here. This one's kind of big, so we'll go with this one. Know what size tags I want to make. Um, I mean, I think I want big ones and little ones. Pretty sure. I'm not sure exactly. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, let's put one up here. I hear eyes. Someone's getting eyes. All right. That one right there. Oh, I think this one's it. This is the last one that we pulled out. Now, um, let's put you right there. There's like a little tiny hole right there. Now, let's see, is there anything else in here that we want to add before we chop it to bits? Now these are really pretty, the white flowers here, but I think the stark white might not go that well. Um, and these are just greenery and these are mushrooms, so I think that's it. There is like just clear with black. I'm not sure that that would go either. So I think that will be it. Now, the fun thing, I, the idea that I wanted to try, and I don't know how this is going to work. I've never done it before. I'm basically just taking this whole collage thing and running with it. Um, bloop. But you guys know how, uh, I'm kind of obsessed with, uh, well, lace. Hee. Let's try and see what happens. So basically, I'm going to cover, not all of it, but I'm going to cover pieces with lace. And I think I'm just going to use this one because um, it's all I have left, honestly. And I think like in spots like this where it's kind of empty and bare and spots like this where it's kind of empty and bare and right here, we'll add a little bit of lace. And I'm not gonna go and do like the whole thing. I'm just gonna go right here and I'm gonna cover that. And then I'll cover this little spot or, you know, whatever. Um, what do you think about that? hope you like that idea because I'm doing it and I'm not sure how it's going to work out never tried it obviously this is like only the third little collage thing that I've done all right all right so and I'm not going to be like super duper worried about like all um, it has to be sealed down but I'm putting enough glue that it will be tacked down because for one, it's going to get cut and for two, it's going to get sewn. So I don't really want a whole heap and wad of glue, you know, bleep it. Oh, I touched it. There's my giant book. We get. Okay. 
So there's that. And then let's take our scissors and cut that. And then I'm going to take this little bit here. Um, I think we're just going to do it here. Ooh. I'm not sure if I want all of that covered up. Okay, we'll just do the one piece because it really, you really have to do the lace. It, I'm seeing that you should do the lace after it's cut because you don't want, I don't want, um, like a card or a tag with like a sliver of lace on it. Uh, necessarily. I don't know what I'm trying to say. I think it would just be better. Like whole pieces like this I think would be okay. But I don't want to go all the way down really anywhere else. Maybe here, but let's see what does that look like. I don't know. We'll try it in the two spots and we'll see what happens. All right. I mean, what's the worst going to happen? We don't like it and we have to use it on something different. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. All right. Let's put our pin back in our glue. I'm going to make the top even because it's easier to cut the bottom than the top. Ugh. I'm going to have to cut that or trim that, rather. Uh after it's cut. I'm not doing it right now. I could not even imagine trying to trim that right now. With this ginormous like piece of paper. Alright. Okay. So I'm going to trim this up. And then I'm going to let this dry and then I'm going to cut it. And so when I'm done, you'll be able to see what the cards look like. And I'm going to sew around them all. So um, I'm not doing that on camera because I'm sure that was fun the last time I did it. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to let this dry and then we're going to cut it up and see what we got. I definitely dig this. So that's the front, and then whoa, this is the back. Sorry, I was moving my feet. I like to sit on my feet for whatever reason. So anyway, that's it. Thank you guys so much for coming along with me again today, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.